When you are touring internationally with a choir and you've built up the music and the sort of prestige, I guess, to come and tour internationally, you'll find it, you know, that you can get into the bigger cathedrals and sort of the more well-known venues. But what happens then if you just leave it at that is, I think you kind of just skim along the surface of the culture. One of the real advantages of working with Eden Gate is that they've built up such connections and I guess social capital, you could say. They're able to arrange meetings and um, cultural excursions and, and performances in places that coming in as an outsider to this culture, um, I would just have no idea. I sang in choirs in college. That was really my first experience with a choir as an ensemble that can make really rich, beautiful music. I had the opportunity to um, narrow my focus specifically to music. Part of that was conducting. And I didn't really have much experience or much you know, opportunity to really work with a choir until I came to Bethlehem Baptist Church and Bethlehem College and Seminary. Part of my focus is developing s skills and gaining experience working with choirs in the setting of a local church. And so when my mentor Chuck told me that I should consider coming to Ireland, uh, because it would be a great experience to work with the choir in this international setting. Um, I couldn't really say no. Now I'm privileged to say that my first real experience conducting a choir has been an international tour of the Republic of Ireland and Northern Ireland. I, I feel more seasoned than I should be after just two weeks, I think. And a lot of that has to do with the way that Eden Gate has put this tour together. Eden Gate has done so much work to prepare for our arrival. So much networking, so much arranging of places to eat and places to sing and places to see and, and take in the culture. But in the time that we've been here, they've also been doing that with our group so that they haven't just sort of made all these opportunities for us and then sort of left it up to us to you know, make the most of them. They really kind of helped us understand what we were doing, helped us enjoy the places we were. Um, you know, made fun of our attempts at Irish accents. I mean, it, it, was, it was really a special thing in that I feel like I want to come back and do another tour or trip or anything with Eden Gate.